Okay, cool. Hundred home done. Yay. Now we have Lauren. At the very least, create it. Whether I want to do it right now or not. Hmm. Well, no. Maybe not right now. But what other options do I have? Well, let's see. Lawrence. That place. Contemplation. I don't really want to go in there quite yet. And I could do. Let's roam around the nightmare immenses for. That's not the way to the nightmare. This is not this way. <laughs> Might as well try to make a little bit of progress through this place. A little bit, anyways. There's some winter lanterns and shit around here, anyways. I can kill them. Get some gems, maybe. Stuff like that. So I do have 31. That's not very, that's not very good. Not that much. What do you shit? But hey, so long as I can actually get the damn guns that go off on them, I should be fine. Yes. Quiet, Murgo. Oh, right, I forgot that it was up. Right, right. Right. And normally I would just go to the other one. Oh, let's see. The iron door takes me directly to the fucking... I'm just contemplating. I mean, I have the key, but taking that takes me directly to the brain, which no, is not what I want. There's a better method of taking out the brain. I want to take it out from that spot, because I believe I have to more or less fight it there. While it's building a frenzy and all that much shit. The other way's a hell of a lot easier. Alright, where's my blood echoes? Something stole my blood echoes. You stole my blood e What the f- Give me my blood echoes back. How'd you get it? Whatever. Okay. I don't believe the puppets come back to life. I think they're dead permanently. Keyword, I think. Nope. Oh, fuck it. Right. I'll go back through Mikolaj's silly place. Maybe the ones in here just don't show up. Okay, I can go down there now, and I think there's something down there. Something good, maybe? Hello. No, it's not moving. Because I know there's a bunch of weirdos down here. Probably disappeared. What a jerk. Because I know there's a big one down here, too, I believe.
Hey. Hey. Oh, oh, oh. No, what? Moon. Okay, Moon I, Moon, I believe, is the Blood Echoes one. But I, I want them blood chunks. Jerk. Here we go higher. Yeah. I'm trying to think. This is part of Mikolash's happy place, wasn't it? Yeah, I recognize this spot. Where I kept getting lost and missing the goddamn door that was over here. Well, that, not that it matters. The thing, yeah, that one. I kept walking past it. It annoyed me so much. It made me angry. Chunks to upgrade uh, the weapon I'm using right now. This weapon's quite nice. Well, of course, there's those guys. Just set that one up for right now. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, right. Yeah, that leads to the very end. I want to go down that. That's a long one. How so annoying. to ride back up again. Maybe. There, made it. Trick is not to roll because you'll probably hit that thing up there and die. Stealth our way through here if we want. It works for the most part. <laughs> Shit! I'm dead. I mistimed it. Great, okay, this is gonna take several tries. Because now I have to wait for the goddamn elevator to, to make another shot at this.
too. Come at me. Oh yeah. Blood echoes back, and I got some pills. Of course, I got some pills. Why for? Okay, the next one I think is on that side. Okay, well I have to go that way anyways. I mean, like straight directly this side. For more patrols and stuff. With it, I heard the sound. You jerk! This part's already a pain in the ass. Come on. Also, give me gems. That's all I want from you guys. Do I go to the elevator again? Shit. Let's do that on my own time. Do you know how long I don't do do how I don't have, know how long that's gonna actually take. Okay. Hmm. I just do option two. They don't chase you very far. And we're done. They don't go in here. He's going down, right? I'll deal without getting my blood because I can always get it back later. Not from them, of course, but, you know, just killing enemies. Going into the Chalice Dungeons would be a better means of being able to get them at this point. the brain of Mensis. Now we don't have to worry about that thing anymore. This is the ones right above me. See me too easily. 
Stop that. Fuck. Oh, barely got that. Stop looking at me! Fuck you! Got rid of the brain so I can get it here more easily now. I don't even remember what's inside that stupid chest, but I want it anyways. And I can get here from the iron door that I mentioned earlier, which is back way a uh, good ways actually. I can get back to that same room through there. I just need to go to a different lamp. Gotcha. Oh, whatever. I thought about it for a second. <laughs> okay, anyways, we need to get to the E, where that uh, locked door was, which will just take us right back to where we were. No worries. It's somewhere around here. Where, but somewhere around here. I think. I don't even remember where the fuck that door is. This leads to the one part of Mikolash's boss fight. Probably not there. Well, crap. Where the hell was it? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> right to where the brain was. So the brain would have been right about here. There is something in there, but before we do that, kill it. I just need to get across there and wait until it turns around. <sighs> and season. 
Alright, come at me. There we go. Alright, what's inside of here and was it worth it? Oh, the choir, but okay. Not exactly worth it. It heals, but it's for like multiplayer though. I did hear about a interesting glitch of getting a of having a monster chase after you and you can heal them in the chalice dungeons specifically. I would say look it up. I forget which video it was. But somehow, somehow got um, one of the beasts uh, that. Uh, damn, I don't even remember what the damn thing was called. It's that one beast that I fought at the bottom of uh, th uh, the healing church, the one that can cast fire spells and shit. It's aggressive against all mobs, for whatever reason, and you can use the choir bell to heal it. It's a weird little thing. Anyways, this is what we came here for. The blood rock. So now we have that thing. Yay. Hello. Oh, oh, I know where I am. Alright, well, coming over here is actually worthwhile because this is also what I wanted to come here for. I'll just ignore these guys for right now. Get rid of this one first, though. He's just gonna cause me problems. Oh, okay. Because the person, because the one down here is going to get mad at me. Because of you. Because you make all of them mad at me. Like that. Shit, this is going to cause problems. Fuck! I pushed the gun button! Please! Damn it! Now I get to waste more time getting back over here. I didn't even want to fight you, you... I just wanted to kill you so I could quickly get past you so I can get to the goddamn elevator that's over here. Ugh. I mean, at least I can get to the elevator that's closer to here. Because all I have to do is just go right here. After I bring it back down. So many extra steps, jeez. Okay, at least that one doesn't take very long to get back. There's a special elevator in this place. It's good. Killing you guys because you're gonna cause me problems if I don't. I know it for a fact. I just saw it. Alright. I'm gonna take out this jerk again. Wrong move. Watch your axe. Come on. Yeah! It knows. There's, okay, there's the elevator that I'm looking for.
Oh, okay. Nah, keeping this on is probably good. Because we're about to go down real far. Look, it's our friend. Giant brain. Still alive. Doesn't cause frenzy damage anymore. But we can now do something else with them. Um, gestures. That's not what we're doing anyways. Switch. To make contact. And now we hold this pose for a moment. Just wait for it. I think it takes about a full minute or something like that. Time now. There we go, Moon. Moon is blood echoes, yes. Ah, uh, yes, and we got all three of them. Excellent. Now then. Has a lot of health. You see why I didn't want to kill it earlier? With all that fun stuff. Just know if it causing frenzy damage to you the entire time. Slightly more damage. Oh, yeah, way more. All right, we got the living string. Cool. Oh, we'll just mark your mark because why? Why not? That's mostly what I came here for. The living string is important because it's required to get into the very last chalice dungeon. Now that I've gotten it, I believe I can buy them now. Not that I really need them. You only really need one, period. I can come back to this place later. There's not really much to do here. There's really not much. There's really not much to this place left, to be completely honest. Until the last boss of here. So I imagine that I will be getting more gems, so that I can properly go into the next set of dungeons. Oh, I want to check. <laughs> Uh, Living string for ten. Pretty cheap, but you don't really need it. <laughs> so yeah, probably grind gems in the nightmare. Come back here. Start doing the Lauren dungeon. And all that good shit. Okay. So Lauren dungeon. Next. Since then, 
I, ki I killed a few of the Winter Lanterns from the Nightmare for a little bit. Didn't kill them nearly as much as I w wanted to. They kept giving me a lot of, um... I, I think they only killed, gave me gems the first time I killed the both of them again. And then they gave me nothing but bullets every other time, so I just gained two levels. Putting them both into skill. And... Upgrade my one weapon to full. Oh, well, both of, both of the ones I'm using right now, since I'm probably just gonna stick with both of them. They change around their uh, things. So, physical attack 18. That uh, this one has a cursed one that increases stamina cost, but I think I can manage that. Hopefully. And church pick. I don't think I changed anything on that one. I wasn't able to get anything. Well, yeah, they weren't giving me any cursed gems, so I couldn't make any good use of some of that stuff. Though I did bother to upgrade my pistol and put this on there, because I realized, oh yeah, that affects it so long as it's out. So I should be doing considerably more damage now. I also changed these around a bit. I put uh, the stamina boost to make up for the stamina loss thing from the other one. And kept two of these. Keeping that on for right now, because the others don't really affect much of anything and you know item discovery more blood vial drops or whatever else gems etc might as well stick with that for right now for the moment I mean there's a side quest to actually get the hunter rune which is considerably better than all the other ones by the fact that it's it just increases your stamina recovery speed and it's just straight up better than all the other ones because it actually does something that's uh, that's actually noticeable and worthwhile. Let's move that. But that requires you to fight a very annoying boss. Not so much boss as hunter who deals a lot of damage and is a total dick. I haven't even tried fighting him yet, but you know, maybe sooner or later. So I believe this is our first depth four dungeon now that I think about it. Pay attention, because they're... This is the Eloran Dungeons. They're filled with beasts. Man, that guy actually took a, took a number of hits, I see. Hello! Whoa! Oh god. Fuck. Shit! Camera got stuck on the fucking wall! <laughs> I couldn't see what I was doing. Right. I, had, I thought that there was two guys in there. Oh. And one of those ladies. This floor is already fantastic. <sighs> the only thing I need to get here are the Bastards of Lauren. I believe there's two on the second floor and two on the third floor. I only need one of them. That's the important factor. I only need one of them because I can buy the rest of Insight. Alright, All right, the first one's right over here. Hello, come here. Last one was probably right at the very end. Yeah, you got my blood echoes. Good boy. Much better. Hmm, I did 3,000 damage. I'm contemplating if having three of those claw mark runes is actually doing anything, or if the game only takes the effect that I ha of having one equipped, making getting duplicates of those completely pointless. I'm not entirely sure. Also, these places have lots of lightning. Room without worrying about the stuff. Okay, so they can swap between spiders and those guys. 
guess I never really noticed that. Also, you can no no notice lightning in here. It can't hurt you or anything. It's just a fancy effect that's only in the Lauren dungeons. So that effect. Nah. So the effect even then. I was looking at that red effect. I'm not entirely sure what that one is. I don't actually know what most of those buff type stuff are. Oh. Okay. Pretty much going into these places with you know fire damage. Um. Yeah, fire damage, serrated damage, all that good shit. Good idea, because pretty much everything in these things are weak to them. sure there aren't any spiders. Oh, okay, those are just candles. Oh, that one was, though. I'm getting a decent amount of blood. Whoa! I guess I wasn't paying attention to how many blood, how much... Ah! Fuck! I wasn't paying attention to the amount of blood echoes I was getting from these. I walked in here with 200. Good shit. So now I can actually start getting levels at a much faster rate. Ah! I can't, can't see. <clears throat> Too foggy in there. <laughs> those blood echoes back. That was a lot.
Lucy. Well, cool. I just went around in a circle. I completely forgot about that. Hopefully spiders aren't following me. That dude is. Eighty-five K. You know, go back to town, gain the level. It's worthwhile. Damage up. be a potentially good room for leveling up if I feel the need to grind in here. I see that. Oh, okay. That's what except on that trap back there. No, it was just the other one. Hook. Right. <laughs> oh, I almost fell for that again. Okay, so the far back is good. 
And there's at least one other door on one of these sides. happen a little bit too often. Oh, ladder, right. in this room. fell into any of those. Well, granted, I had a PSN at that time. And I had messages saying don't step there, so I just assumed not to step there. Access to the boss, and maybe possibly another treasure room thingy. Don't know. We'll find out soon enough. I'm pretty sure I know what the boss for this one is. It's probably uh, the fire, the guy that can cast fire attacks and stuff. The bipedal werewolf dude. I don't remember what it what it's called. I know the second one is a uh, blood starved beast because I remember dying to that one and just not continuing this particular dungeon. I just grabbed the bastards of lore and left. I didn't come back to it till way, way later until it was in New Game Plus. Okay, so there is one th over here. annoyed, you know. Please be careful. And then roaming into a room and having a bunch of dogs jump you out of nowhere. Reed was 
wasn't going to get the better of me right there. That's the lower part, so... That would make me imagine that there's... That there's probably a bridge on this side. Or not... Oh, yes. Okay. These are two different spots, right? I forgot the Lauren Dunn's have uh, this type of design in them. Fancy bridges. They go across a gigantic ass chasm. in here it's really hard to see I can see the guy there oh treasure room hmm I don't see anything in here like no enemies or anything so I'm very paranoid this place. Is that all of them? I'm surprised that there wasn't uh, anything else sitting in front of the chest. to be it for this room. Good. Good. I guess take the lower path so it's down there. You can see those. I, I'm pretty sure that's to the next area, but you can't like drop down there. Ugh. I don't like this one. Lauren Silver Beast right there. Hmm. I was expecting that to go a lot worse. Cool. Looks like we're done here. Excellent. Yeah, I'll just do this. Spin my blood echoes, gain levels, boss time. That good stuff.
Stretching. Oh, I do have some coal. Mm. Why not? No, not enough. Okay. I should have figured as much. Very sad if I died and lost all those blood echoes. Not that it would take terribly long to get it all back, but you know, at this point. But you know, I'd still be sad. Okay. Oh, right, okay, I was about to say, were there enemies in this room? Of course there were. Alright, we are about to go to the first boss, which, yeah, like I said, I'm pretty sure I know what it is. It, beast Possessor, that's the... dumb mistakes on this thing. Shit. Very nice chunk of its health. That did not work like I was hoping it would. the dodges. Oh. Right, I really should not let him hit me with that, because that be beefs him up if I remember correctly. So he's going to be a lot harder now. Yep. I missed that opportunity heavily. Okay, we're good. Just need to get better at the timing on those attacks. A chunk. Nice. Next floor. There's a treasure 
treasure area. I think I know it's in that treasure area too. But we're gonna hit up this thing real quick. And gain a level, because I don't want to risk losing it just so that I can make less trips. 